I was looking through horror games this morning and trying to find an idea for a video, uh, something interesting. And obviously, since I'm poor, don't look at this. <laughs> but since I have no money, I want to look at free horror games. And then I got curious and was wondering, what's the best rated free horror game? So Steam allows you to look through certain things. So basically, I narrowed things down by horror, uh, the price being free, and then I sorted by user reviews to find the best reviewed free horror game. Um, the first one that comes up is actually a psychological horror game, and I think I might save that for another video, but I want it to be just straight horror. So the second one that comes up is actually the user tags don't have horror in it, so skipping that one. Same thing with the third one, but the fourth one I found is called The Supper, and it does have horror in the tags, and it's the best rated, and it looks like it came out like three years ago, um, but I was curious, so... Uh, how good the game is so let's find out oh that's loud uh the volume was <laughs> insanely loud for me i don't know if it was insanely loud for you guys but for me it was insane so i'm gonna just let's go three quarters and let's just try it out oh it's still so loud <laughs> The Supper. Bite sized game. Shout out to Octavi Navarro. Hopefully, I didn't mess your name up too badly. I love the accordion style intro music. It feels like church. Those bubbles are so unsettling sounding. Psst. Mrs. Appleton. Left click to continue. Wake up. What kind of creature is this? <laughs> what is this? It looks like someone cut off your legs. Uh, I'm sorry, Miss Appleton. I know your old bones are tired. What's wrong with... Is that your hair? Are you wearing a mask? What am I looking at? Things were so much easier before, weren't they? But there's no time to rest. Look at the time. Who's talking? Who? Who am I? Customers will be arriving any minute now. And we don't want to keep them waiting with empty bellies, do we? I suppose not. What am I... Oh, it's a point and click. Okay. Special sauce? Should I be doing something with this? I seem to be confused by that. Where, where can I go? Special sauce and dining room. The music is going wild. Uh, light the candles. Okay. I know it's dark in here. Who's talking to me? Some light will make the place much more inviting. All right, let's light that shit up. I'm just gonna do it with my hands? Oh, okay. We actually have to find uh, matches or something. Okay, well, can I go over here? No? Okay, oh, there must be matches in here. Empty pot? I, I am a very confused lady. Embers. I could just pick one up. Oh, use the dustpan. I'm, oh, wait. Use the fire tongs, I guess. Grab the embers. With the with the with the tongs. Oh, I'm, I'm so smart. Now what do I do? Empty pot, I guess? What if you put the embers in there? Okay, no. I'll light the candles with that. Hold on, I'm smart. Is that gonna work? <laughs> Why what? Oh, okay. Well done, Miss Appleton. Now we just have to wait for some starving souls to pass by. Yes, we do. Empty water jug. Should I fill it? I should probably fill it. Hold on. Solid wax. Should I fill the water jug with the special sauce? Mmm, it smells delicious. Here, Miss Appleton horses. Here they come. Dude, I'm not ready. <laughs> I haven't prepared any food. I can't move at all. First customer's here, and I have, I have literally nothing prepared. You think it could be them? I don't know. Can we fill this? What? Okay, no, we cannot. I was curious. Maybe with the, the wax. Let's go greet our guests, I guess. Hello, guys. You all look inviting. I totally get it. Is there an octopus on your head eating your brain? <laughs> look at the chest. These are the men we've been looking for. Are they? Let's find them a place to stay quickly. Of course. So we got a shark, a guy getting killed by an octopus slowly. 
Or just an octopus eating someone. Uh, what do the gentlemen want to start with? And then we got an old man with a weird beard. Old man? Excellent choice. Pigeon a la sauce. Chef specialty. Who's the chef? Oh. Spicy red swordfish, personal favorite. Okay, certainly. Lots of omega-3s, right? Fish. Aren't you eating your own kind? Hand and tongue? Ugh. I was right, you were wrong. Dude, the music? Hold on, I'm so sorry. The music is killing me, it's so loud. I didn't mean to click that. I'm sorry. Hold on. Wait. Wait. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not meant to play the game. I don't know how I. Uh, I failed so miserably at clicking the correct buttons. But hold on. <laughs> it's still so loud. <laughs> oh, okay. I found the the recipes list, and what actually goes in the recipes that they were ordering. Uh, they all have special sauce, so that must be the secret sauce, obviously. Um, classic plump human hand and a slimy tongue. It's all, you know, just typical stuff you'd find at any restaurant, really. Here are the customers. All right, let's try this again. Oh, also, I picked up some candle wax. That's the other thing that's in my inventory right now. In case you wanted to know. You think it could be them? Right, yes, of course it's them. What's up, Holmes? Octo head, dinosaur man, and beard galore. I'm not a big naming guy. So that's a spicy red swordfish mind controlling beast on the left. But the mind controlling beast on the left. I get it. Mind control. I get it now. I was right, though. Pigeon for the sick old man. Yep. And I find for the dangerous looking blue shark. It's a shark, not a dinosaur. Technically, I think they're the same. Of course, I'll serve a delicious secret sauce. Go fetch the ingredients. Don't forget to check the recipes in the kitchen wall if you have any problem. Don't worry, I already checked. Do we have like a place I can get ingredients? Because I don't like I can have ingredients. Where am I supposed to get this stuff? Where do I, uh, where do I make the food? Let's open the chest. Be patient. Oh. Oh, I remember what you all wanted. I'm just not sure how to, like, make the food. Anyone else have any ideas? How do I make the food? Empty pot. I need to add stuff to it. So, like, where do I get the ingredients? Doorbell? Outside. Oh, do I have to, like, find stuff? What's the lever do? We don't know. Probably opens the jail door. Pigeon. Oh, I need to like figure out how to like beat his ass. All right, we have to kill a pigeon somehow. What's the wooden cart do? Hope you're not thinking of climbing up there. Why not? I could do it. You think I can? All right, I guess we're gonna go to this boat first. I got no other ideas right now. Rope ladder. Hey, fisherman, how's it going? Oh. <laughs> Alright, you're dead. Poor old Pete, I always knew he'd lose his head sooner or later. No. Is this a boot? Wet boot. Okay, I take it I'll need that for something. I take it I need a knife to cut the ropes so I can get on the ship. I'm learning everything. Hold on. What do I need to, like, figure out? To hit the pigeon, I don't think I need the water jug. What about the wet boot? To, like, throw it at it. Get wrecked. Oh my gosh, no! I didn't actually mean to kill it with it. That's the main ingredient for the... Now let's finish the dish. Wait, that's not what I meant to do. Alright, well, it needed to be done. I can't fin I can't make the soup without the pigeon. Sorry, brother. I guess we'll throw the pigeon in. Sorry, pigeon. What? What? Okay, are you are you psychotic? What do I need? Cover with special sauce. Do I just need to throw you in? Oh, that's it. Oh my gosh, I'm insane. Ready to be served. Alright, I'll throw the pigeon. Right at the pigeon boy. 
you wanted the pigeon, if I'm not mistaken. So here you go. Boom. Bon appetit. Oh my gosh. Take it easy, Chief. Oh. I think... Oh, fuck! <laughs> oh my gosh. I didn't realize it was going to kill you, brother. Don't worry, they're used to passing out in taverns. I don't think he's passed out. I think he's dead. They won't notice he stopped breathing. Who's talking to me? <laughs> Why are you so not concerned about anything? Uh, what do I need the scissors for? Cutting the rope ladder, surely. That's probably what we should do first. Cut the rope ladder, get onto the boat. Cut that shit, brother. Cut, Cut that. I need to cut this. Oh, there we go. All right, get me up here, dude. Damn, the back be looking thick. Oh. <laughs> Excuse me, what? Puddle. I have a water jug. Hold on. Not that we need water for anything specific, but we'll take it. Yeah, three three drops. That should do it. Oh, I just gotta water the seedling and it all comes together. Thank you, my my pepper boy. Thank you. Easy cheese. I think I can cut off the swordfish tail, but let's check out the captain's cabin. You're not looking too good, Cap. I think I know this guy. He tastes his blood. Who are you? I feel like I have like a little demon on my shoulder. Sip. Oh yes, indeed. Captain Clint McMurray, my sister's second husband. Who's your sister's first husband? You won't be beating anyone up ever again, Clint. I'm happy we cleared that up. I guess I'll just go? Oh, I got the knife. That's how you cut off the... Oh my gosh, I'm so smart. I'm so smart, I don't even know it. Whoa, you aren't looking... Oh no, actually, you're looking totally fine. I thought the X on his head was his eyes, and I was like, oh my god, he's dead. But I was mistaken. Now let me cut off the tail. Hold up. Easy cheese. And I think we just special sauce. Maybe one at a time? Oh, we need the pot. Hold on. Pot me. What? Oh! oh my gosh, it's easy cheese. I'm so good. Well done, Miss Appleton. Our spicy red swordfish is ready to be served. I agree. My brother, you wanted the swordfish, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. Here you go. Enjoy. Oh, yeah. That tongue, dude. God damn. Oh, he just flings it up. Taking a nap. Just like your homie over here. Satisfied stomach. Worth dying for. It's funny. Come on, laugh. I'm, I'm, I'm laughing my ass off. This is great. Take the jail key. Open up the last thing. Make the last dish. Let's go. I'm efficient. Well, we have the keys. Skeleton hand. How are we going to make it have meat on it again? I don't know why I thought the wax would do something. <laughs> What's the lever do? Maybe put the hand on the lever. No? That doesn't work? Oh, come on. Chest? Patient. All right, I'm being patient. Hold on. We gotta just figure out what this hand does. What's the hand do? I need a tongue and I need a hand. Okay, put the solid wax and make it in a boiling wax. Then maybe make the hand into a hand with the scale. Okay, now it's a hand. I need a tongue. Whose tongue can I, can I just use this? Oh, you can just use his tongue. Oh. <laughs> I knew that, obviously. Boom, easiest dish I've ever made. Boom, last dish. Consider it served. Come here. Hold on, no, 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 don't take your order. Yes. Bon appetit. 
Amigo. One bite. That's oh, <gasps> Ooh, <laughs> looks a little pale there. No satisfied customers. Such a delicacy can't help us be the most discerning of stocks. Well done. The service was impeccable. I know. What can I say? I don't think our customers have any complaints, do they? You're complaining if you're dead. Great. Now let's clean this mess before the stench gets the attention of the authorities. What do you mean, mess? They're all just sleeping, right? Check. Do we do something with the patient? What, 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 what do you mean? Clean this mess. How do I clean mess? Oh, the lever, maybe. Have I, like, figured it out now? He didn't drop anything when he died. I guess I'll go outside. Oh. What? Wait, I can't go this way? Wooden cart. I understand. <laughs> this will be useful for carrying the bodies out, of course. <laughs> Where am I going to put them? In the jail cell. I'm so smart. Well, at least it's not going to make me... Eat. I'm singing? Yo-ho, yo-ho? No, that wasn't a pirate song. I feel like it should have been, though. Yo-ho, yo-ho, the pirate. What? What's the lever do? We've never used a grinder with such charge, especially. Let's hope their bones don't get stuck. Bro, we're gonna have special sauce for days. <laughs> well done. I'm gonna have special sauce forever. Is it the ghosts that are waking me up and talking to me all night? Thank you, Miss Appleton. I appreciate all you've done. Who are you in this chest? At last, I'm allowed to rest, and so are you. Whoa, I have so many good memories of you. What? That was my husband? You're my dearest friend. Oh, excuse me, friends. <laughs> Only friends, bro. Relax. Wait, what? When those beasts dragged me out of our kitchen, I knew I was done for. Whoa, they killed us both? The shark took my freaking legs! I swear I didn't steal that gold nugget from them. Yep. I want it fair and square, dude. I swear. Don't worry, man. I'm sleeping soundly. No regrets. While I was anguishing, suffocating inside this chest they put me in. There's only one thing I knew for certain. You wouldn't rest until you found me dead or alive. You'd be sorry you had to lose your own sanity along the way. I lost a lot, man. Lost my legs, lost my sanity, lost my hair. It's turned into a ball sack. <laughs> Please find a quiet place to bury my bones near the old well. Damn, this got way, way sentimental out of nowhere. It's time for me to leave this apple thing. Sweet dreams. Okay, goodbye. Thank you. Sweet dreams to you as well. Damn, bro. What was the special sauce before, though? Makes you wonder. What were they cooking up before? Damn, that was crazy. What the fuck? Not what I expected, honestly. The supper. Wow, all right. Well done. I think this was like a solo project, maybe. Written and designed by him? Oh, okay. A few other people helped out as well. Freesound.org, man. You gotta hit him up with the sound effects. Come on. Thank you for playing. Ah, you're very welcome. Sorry for killing you with a boot. Support the developers on all games you like. So that was The Supper. Um, not what I expected for the highest rated horror game on Steam, but I will say I really enjoyed it. I thought the story was interesting. Um, 
I think these are really cool. I think I'm going to do another one. Probably get a horror game that's a little bit more scary, horror-esque. Um, but this one was really cool. And let me know what you guys thought. And if you have any ideas for the future versions of this, if I should do something a little bit differently and maybe uh, filter things differently when I'm looking for the game on Steam, let me know. Um, but until then, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.